it all goes back. I mean, we keep saying we got it down in double digits, but uh, what they shot 56% for the game. So, you know, while I understand we cut it, you know, cut the lead and everything, I don't know who we're kidding, thinking we're going to play defense like that and then expect to stop them. Um, even if it's a two-point game or even if we take the lead, they'll probably hit a big shot um, um, late in the game because they have a rhythm. So, you know, we, um, we're not getting off to good starts um, defensively. It's like uh, uh, whether it's the coverages or, 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 or just man-to-man -man defense, they're, they're blowing by us. We, we're not helping each other. Um, or, or we have no weak side defense. I mean, it's just, it's just, uh, it just wasn't there for the past few games. So. These are clearly things that you guys are addressing and working in practice and watching on film. Can you see a particular thing that is the initial trigger that gets you out of the correct disposition? Well, I mean, you know, there are always going to be initial triggers, but I mean, there's so many things for us, pick and rolls, side pick and rolls, one-on-one -on -one defense, pin downs, transition. I mean, we actually did a good job on transition today. It's just we can't, we haven't put it together yet. And, um, you know, I guess it's a process. That's what I'm going to keep telling myself. And, uh, you know, to keep myself sane, but, you know, eventually we're going to have to turn the corner. Um, you know, it's been a couple weeks now. Uh, this is our eighth game, ninth game tonight. We have to, uh, we have to start showing ourselves that, uh, you know, we know what we're doing out there. Chris, did you feel like you guys were disjointed tonight with Wade out and with some of the other personnel changes? Uh, so guys playing that had that don't normally play. Well, yeah, it's difficult. Um, you know, when you have. Uh, of course, a starter and an all-star like D out um, is something that you have to get used to. But, um, you know, how many points do we score? That's enough points to win. And uh, I feel strongly about that. That's enough points to win. And, you know, we have to play better defense. I think that's what it all comes down to. Our shot selection was, it was poor in the beginning of the game, but we eventually got going. Um, we eventually started to figure it out, play together and everything, getting the right calls. And, you know, after that, we got we to gotta make a stand. I mean, 103 points, I'll take it. I'll take it every game. When we want to average 103 points for the rest of the season, that's, that's great. But we can't give up 113 or 16 or 20. You know, we gotta, we've got we to gotta play some defense. I suppose if it was doubly disappointing because you had such a nice performance from both Williams and Chalmers. He said no because that's part of the growth process of getting those guys to be able to be in that mode. But was <coughs> at least a missed opportunity with those with that bit of production. Uh, I don't know how to answer that one only because we, we gave up so much. I mean, I don't want to keep harping on it, but you know. Yeah, it's a missed opportunity. You want to, you know, you want guys to play well. You want guys to make sure they're um, stepping up when the time is right. But I mean, it, um, it's on both ends of the court. So while the numbers, um, you know, do look great, um, the opponents still won. So, you know, that's uh, that's all that matters, and we've uh, we've got to do better. What, anything specifically you put your finger on that just wasn't right defensively? I think it was on the weak side. Um, you know, they, this team is going to make enough tough shots. I think if you watch them every day, we know that. Um, but we had too many breakdowns in our coverages. I think, um, you know, we guarded the, the pick and roll okay for, most, for the most part. But, you know, after they kicked it out, um, our rotations, we weren't there. It's like we ran out of guys. I mean... You know, against a team like this, you have to be one step ahead. But I guess that'll come with time. So, you know, um, I guess this is a time where we just have to work on our patience and, uh, you know, just really work the process. And eventually, um, we'll get over the hump. Chris, you talk about patience, but with guys being out, Dwayne tonight, Josh McRoberts, and now Danny yet to play. You guys play five men on a string defense. Don't you basically need everyone together to get the chemistry? Yeah, you do. And um, it, it takes experience. I guess it takes getting uh, getting whooped a couple times to, to, to figure it out. And, uh, you know, that's where the weak side comes in. We we're this, this defensive system is built on trust. And um, we're not there yet. I think that's obvious. Uh, but, 
you know, guys have to take their positions. Guys have to know their rotations. They have to know exactly what they're doing when the ball goes to a certain place. So, you know, while, um, while yeah, we did have guys out and it is tough, I still like winning. I don't like losing.